Hello, my name is Long Twitter. Today I'm going to be telling you about the Ryan Fireball, the first operational Navy aircraft with a jet engine. If you find this video informative today, please subscribe. The story of the Ryan FR-1 Fireball started in 1942 with the United States Navy commissioning manufacturers to build a mixed power plant carrier-based fighter aircraft. Ryan Aeronautical accepted the challenge and they designed the Fireball. First flying in 1944, the Ryan Fireball was obviously the Navy's toe-in-the-water entrance to advanced technologies. The aircraft had a mixed power plant, tricycle landing gear, and a laminar flow wing just like the P-51 Mustang. Only 66 aircraft saw operation in the aftermath. These 66 were powered by two engines. One was a Wright Cyclone radial engine producing 1,400 horsepower, and the other was a General Electric J-31 jet turbine pushing out 1,600 pounds of thrust. These engines gave the Ryan a top speed of 426 miles per hour and a range of 1,000 miles. Since the Ryan was a carrier-based, it had folding wings, strengthened landing gear, and a tail hook for short landings. The Fireball was also armed as it was built for World War II. It carried four half-inch Browning machine guns along with pylons for bombs and rockets. Because it was designed for World War II, the Ryan Fireball was already obsolete when it entered surface. New aircraft ready for the future were now entering service, and the era of piston air power was coming to a close. In 1947, the remaining fireballs were retired from the Navy just two years after entering service. Today, only one aircraft survives in Chino, California. If you enjoyed this video today, please subscribe. Thank you for watching.